Hey, Yamazaki. How you doing? Hello. Hold on. We're having a moment. You need me to put us on the pillow. Okay. Hey, Oh, okay. Is it because it's so fluffy? I feel like I want to have maybe one little bit. Can I do that? Yes. Are we on, going to be on the other one? We are. Oh, we're live on both. Yeah. Okay, good to know. Hello, hello, hello. Bring all these up. Thank you, Bethany. Good morning, people. How's it going? Eva Lawn says, let's go. Anne Marie says hello with a lot of O's. I'm opening up the other one over here. Well, didn't Bethany and... Misty say not to, that they would send you, they would let you know if somebody had a question over there and they would just yeah, post it there. Yeah, I think they would repost it. I'm gonna yeah, just, just trust them. Tana sounds like she needs more coffee. <laughs> I was talking to our puppy Arwen. Um, okay. Good morning. Says hi. Bob Boop says hi. Hi, Bob Boop. Your art is so good. That was Milan Maria George. Thank you very much. Unfortunate Lebanese says hi, Scott. Hello. Um, yeah, the clock says good morning. Tyrannial says my birthday is Monday and this is a beautiful sketch. Oh, uh, well, happy birthday in advance. Happy early birthday. Frey says hello. I have finally managed some decent sleep and I return from the abyss. <laughs> good. Welcome back. Oh, Destiny. Oh, I love it. So pretty. Thank you. Um, everybody likes the clock. You really like hair, huh? Yeah, yeah. I don't have a... People are like, he has a hair fetish. I don't think I do. I just like drawing it. Emma says, good afternoon. I'm everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, Emma, you're so cute. Stephanard says morning. Dark snowification. Good, Good morning, morning, lovely people. It's way too cold this weekend. I'm so sad. It it did get cold, didn't yeah. it? Yeah. And then guess what? Logan says he might have snow. This week coming up, one day, I think it's either Tuesday or Wednesday, it's supposed to be in the 50s. And then the next day, it's supposed to be in the high 70s. I'm like, <laughs> Mother Nature is a little uh, cranky. A little, yeah, she's a little crazy this week. Um, I don't have the Wi-Fi password. Says hi. Hi. Shane Webb. Good morning, gorgeous people. Hope you're both well. And Arvin, of course, a stunning sketch. You're too talented, Scott. Oh, thank you, my friend. Luna, can you maybe draw Asian girls because I am Asian and haven't seen one yet? Oh, here you go. Hope you like it. I made a video on it. These are the ones I've done so far. Unlinked, I actually made it in time. That's rare for me. Jamie says good morning. Hope everyone has a great Saturday. Off to work. Oh, Jamie, have a great that day. Cake you made last night was Chef's kiss. It was beautiful. Dina Mercury says good morning. <laughs> Emma knows all. Emma sees all. Indeed, she does. Terrenial, thank you both. I love your art, and I have my eye on a piece of your art, but I have to wait till payday. Oh, You're so my good. pleasure. Thank you. Thank so you for thinking of me. Haley says, hello, you're so talented. Keep up the great work and stay safe. Thank you very much. We're doing our best. Arvin's trying to kill me slowly. But <laughs> David says, good morning, all. 
Good morning. Avi Regenfish says, hey yo again. Hey yo. Spider says, good morning. This is the first stream I've made it to. Hello. Well, welcome. Oh, dark notification. I'm getting weather migraines. It's annoying. I am so sorry. I know how that feels. It's terrible. I hope you can take medicine and feel better soon. Cranberry Pie says, good morning. Breath of Fresh Air and says, hello. I can't stay because I have a meeting, but I wanted to suggest purple for the hair color. But if you already have a color on mine, then carry on. I know <laughs> she is in capable hands. Have a great day. Thank you so much. <laughs> you know I love purple hair. That's cute. Luna retracted a message. <gasps> Scandalous. Mm -hmm. Lily Jack says, you're back on TikTok. Uh, yes, yes, they, they accepted my appeal. They went, oh, yeah, you didn't do anything wrong. I think I'm good. Okay. says, amazing. Mm, yeah, thank Shannon you. says, sup. Sup. Emma says, it's 18 degrees Celsius, which is 64 degrees Fahrenheit there. Wow. That's warm for you at this time of year, isn't it? Gray says, LOL, Scott. Oh, here you go. Here's some representation. I love it. <laughs> Luna says, oh, thank you. I love your art. My hey, pleasure. Hey, Field here and says good morning all. Hello. Meow says hello. Hello. I really love your art and your art style is the prettiest to keep up with the good work. Thank you very much. Sandra says, hi, I'm here. Hello, Sandra. Well, gosh, I was worried about you, Sandra. I'm glad you're here and you're okay. Samantha says hello. Sandra hello. says that's very beautiful. Thank you. Medley says hello. It's lovely to catch you painting today. Good morning. Thank you. Octopog says, Octopog says, whoa, whoa, a stream, hello. Hello. Shane Webb, I've decided I'm going to tie in some personal art every art time every day while I listen to slash watch this. Will oh. work on the play I'm writing while you draw. Marinate in this gorgeous community's energy. Oh, fantastic. You're so cute. I think it's amazing if you can write while other people are talking. Like, I, I can't, I need silence when I write. He does. He gets in his head. He has to stay in his head. I pull him out of his head. Or pull off his head. One of the two. Um, Frey says, I feel like I've missed so much. My health has me down and out for a couple of weeks. Oh, uh, I hate when that happens. Yeah, I'm sorry. You just kind of have to get through it. Yeah, and then you'll come out on the other side and you'll feel better. Cheesy Fries says, much respect. Oh, thank you. Kaza says, hello. When did you start drawing? Uh, personally, when I was, game. when I was about six or seven. Star says, I'm finally at a live, yay. I'm now taking calls from nine to six and can't watch during work. Good morning, SBC. Oh, Good sorry. morning. Sorry. Well, we're happy you're here today with us. Aurora says, hi. Hello. <clears throat> Living Blindly says, good Saturday morning, everyone. Good morning. Um, MB says, hi. Are you just winging it, or do you have a plan for the shape of the hair going into the drawing at the start? Well, you can maybe see a little bit. I just did like a little pencil. So I kind of penciled it. And it, you can watch yesterday's live uh, on YouTube. That was the beginning of this. Yeah, yeah. So we're just kind of picking up from where I went. But I kind of penciled it all out and then got to about here, I think, yesterday. So I'm just kind of... Finishing it up, and then I'll come up with something for the background, and then we'll keep going. Sandra says, I've seen you draw before, and it's very impressive. Thank you very much. Sam says, I found you on YouTube. Samantha says, what's your favorite medium? Hello. Uh, right now, it is this medium, uh, ink and watercolor. So I'll come over it with uh, watercolors. Spider says, your art is absolutely wonderful. I love coming across it on my shorts. It always teaches me something new and inspires me to keep drawing. I appreciate it a lot. Oh, it was my pleasure. And Emma says, it's nice and sunny and the clocks change here tonight. Oh, wow. I, I hope you can get some sleep. Are you springing ahead like we did? Because that's brutal. You are, because yeah. the way you draw is so smooth and pretty, says Milan. Thank hey, you. Phoenix says, good morning. Good morning. How Tuto says, wow, you so good. Thank you very much. I don't have the Wi-Fi password says, hey dude, I always enjoy watching your videos. It brings me much joy to see beautiful something beautiful being created. And your how to draw videos have helped very much. Thank you. Oh, that makes me so happy. Thank you for telling me that. 
Avi Regenfish says, this hair looks so complicated and even more complicated than my little blending thingy, TBT. <laughs> Hope you can keep up with your motivation. Thank you. Thank you. I'm trying. Frey says, marinate in the energy. I love that. LOL. Yeah, that's... Everybody here is great. Henry says, I got woken up by an oh-so-pleasant leg cramp this morning. At least I'm not late for SBC. Oh. Oh, jeez. I can't stand those. Those are the worst. I'm sorry. I hope you were able to, like, rub the cramp out of your leg so it doesn't hurt anymore. Oh, those are terrible. Black Phoenix says, happy Saturday all. Good morning. Good morning. Ancient Numis says, hi. Awesome artwork. Really Hello. Great. Hello. Absolutely love watching your videos, so thanks so much. Thank you. Destiny says, my favorite is all over Harry Potter art. It is so gorgeous. It inspired me to make my own sketchbook. Oh, oh fantastic. Isn't that great? I love that. Awesome. I hope you could show it to us one day. <clears throat> you should do a um, do a video of a, of a um, flip through of your sketchbook. We'd love to see that. Milan Maria says, the way you reply to all the chat is so sweet. We're trying. We're trying. We're doing our best. There's a lot of you, and we're trying really hard. But we have some great people here who are helping us, and we could not do this without them. Yeah. How Tucho says you are so talented. Mel says, hey, Scott. Hey. Hey, Karechi's here and says, hey. Mary Patel says, love your work, Scott. Frey says, I love this portrait so much, Scott. It's so pretty. Thank you. Karechi says, Scott is all over my YouTube homepage. Ha ha. Oh, that's great. And Karechi also said, asks, how are you guys? Doing good, thank you. We are much better today. I well, think we need to... so great yesterday, but we're much better today. We need to come up with something for the background. Um, how Chuchu says, talented man over here. It's a hoo hair. A hoo hair. <laughs> it does look like hoo hair, doesn't it? Cheyenne says, do you have TikTok? Yes, yeah, we're, we're live streaming both on TikTok and YouTube. We are indeed. Um, Brooke Benjamin, hello, just subbed yesterday after watching you burn your sketchbook cover video. It was really beautiful. Also, this is my first stream today. Oh, welcome. It's so nice to meet you. Brooke, we are happy you are here. Glad you could make it. Alex Draws and Stuff says, good morning, friends. Good morning. Aurora wants to know what is your favorite painting ever? Um, He's I... over in the cabinet, people, rummaging through. I think it is uh, the movie poster that I did for Animal Crackers. And there is a shadow right across it, but you guys can kind of get a picture of it. Um, Guto Klug says, good morning. I've recently found your channel, and I love painting while watching your streams. I'm glad I'm catching this one live. Thank you. What do you guys what do you guys think of this for the background? This might be kind of pretty. Why is it not showing me? Oh, there it is. I'm not giving my opinion because every time I give my opinion, Scott does the opposite of what I like. So I'm not giving my opinion anymore. Um, I haven't been on a live in forever. It feels nice to see everyone. How is everyone? Says Sam. Good, thank you. Hello there says, sorry I'm a bit late today, but I got a donut. Oh. <laughs> that is a very Hello good excuse. Hello there, we never apologize for donuts. Yeah. We don't apologize for donuts. Mm -mm. Oh, Emma says, yep, we lose an hour. Are you good at origami? I am not. Um, Aspen sent you a dollar, 99. Oh, thank says, you very hey, much, I'm Aspen. I'm so happy to learn. Oh my God. Thank you. Um, Octopog, I just realized I've been watching the stream with a six minute delay for a while. Oh no. Oh, uh, John Harvey says, good morning. I'm a blacksmith who's revisiting drawing to create concept designs for customers. That is but so I cool. I also want to do figure drawing just for fun. I really enjoy your content. That is very cool. Our friend is a blacksmith. Huck to Pog says, so hello in real time now. Frey, oh, and could pester you about doing something nope. live? Yeah. With, uh, da, da, da. Yes. Frey, we will do that. Um, Arden says, so cool. Good morning, everyone says, Battle Brooks. I hope everyone is doing well today. Um, Suki Dookie says, morning, how are you all? We're good, thank you. Art by Lee says, hello. Book binding is fun. Miracular says, hi. Hello. Um, Alex Drossen said, picked up a Windsor Newton watercolor set last night. I can't wait to try it out. Oh, fantastic. 
Bisma says, whoa, his hand. Oh, your bracelets are so cool. I want one. Oh, thank you. Um, it's looking great. It says, unknown monkey. Brooke says, love the way you draw hair. You make it seem so easy. Do you have a Discord? Maybe we could have a voice chat one day. Absolutely. Through sketchbooks. We do have a Discord. Absolutely. Yeah. There's a link in the bio. Yep. What's the coffee choice today? Um, today is the, the, um, Carmel proprietary tea from the Tuck Box. Yeah, we're tea people. I needed a very mellow start to my morning. I was up late and then the puppy woke me up early. So I needed some mellow tea today. Not like, wake me up and move, but I needed like, you know, I needed a little bit of a chill. Um, one of a kind says, flowers. <laughs> Um, how about starch with background or leaves? The flowers look gorgeous. Michael Robin says hi. Hello. Um, one of a kind says, and good morning. Good morning. Um, Aveda says the hair looks gorgeous. Finley, hello, how are you two this morning? We are good, thank you. Um, that looks amazing, that's so pretty. Erica says good morning, everyone, big hugs. Good morning. Everyone says they really like it. Uh, Joseph says, hi, it's my birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Um, they are liking that for the background. What about a salt texture on top of that? I don't know what that is, but that's that. Like adding salt to the watercolor? I don't know. I don't know what that means. I just want to go through the stencil drawer, says Jamie Brown. <laughs> <laughs> Sandra retracted a message. Scandalous. Um, let's see. Joseph says, I love donuts. I'm sure you didn't bring one for everybody in the live. Come on. Um, so beautiful and outstanding. What's your favorite donut? Oh gosh, chocolate. Come on. Okay, give me a donut. Um, Chi says, Hiya, this is my first stream ever and just Help. sub around two, two days ago and I regret nothing. Well, hello. I'm Welcome. so happy to meet you. Ooh, Emma's tea today is black chai with ginger and elderberries. Wow, that sounds good. Stefner says, donuts, I want one. How did the podcast yesterday go, by the way? Also, can we know the name of it now? Um, oh, it was Film Addict, I think, was the name of the podcast. Uh, and it went very well, thank you. It was... It was uh, sweet that you remembered. That was Finley remembered. Yeah, it was uh, it was fun. We talked about animal crackers and 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 stuff like that because you know it was film addict. There you go. Um, Iggy eyebrows says good morning from Wales. Good morning. Um, I think a lot of people here love drawing. Um, Jill Rose mom says good morning. Any watercolor brushes you recommend? Yeah, the uh, cheapest things you can find. I have a link in my bio to. Um, your these the, the travel paint brushes and and I gotta say they've lasted forever, um, so I recommend those. Scott is not a brush connoisseur. I'm, I'm not. He's not. Um, good evening from somewhere in Southeast Asia. <laughs> That's Iman. Well, well hello. Iman, good morning from somewhere in the United States. Me, I love drawing so much. Um, Sabatha says, you are amazing. Oh, thank you. No, Sabatha, you are amazing. Um, Brooke says, we'll join the Discord right now. Thanks. Looking forward to all of the art tips. Um, Guzzi says, good morning, SBC. Julianna good morning. Says, hi. Hi. How was your day so far? Uh, we well, are... we're vertical. Yeah, I think that's good. pretty good. Looking at the flat, my dad always used to say, if you're looking at the flowers from the right side, you're having a good day. In my country, it's evening. Well, good evening. Ansu says hello. Lily says hello. it's not on the link, but do you have a favorite place to find stencils? Um, oh boy. You're right, it isn't on the link. Um, I, I, I do Michaels or uh, Joanne Fabrics. And let me throw this out there really quickly. Um, I was at Michael's two days ago and they're having a huge sale on their stencils. A lot of them are being clearanced out, but they're not back with the drawing supplies. They're up in the wood supplies. 
So they're in the very they were in the middle of our store and they were mixed in with the acrylic paints and the woods. But there it's a huge sale on them. I think they're getting rid of a lot of them. Maybe they're making room for new stuff. Um, Frey says, yeah, throw salt on wet watercolor to create a texture on the wash. Yeah, I remember doing that in college. That was fun. Um, Harissi was here, says, hi, first time being on your stream. So Hello. So nice My to meet you. My question is something I personally struggle on the daily with. How do you always think of what to draw? Um, I have themes, so like this is my hair theme, then I have a Lord of the Rings theme, I have, uh, so different sketchbooks have just different themes. Um, that's what I recommend is, is take some time to think about what you'd like to do. I did 60 days of studying the masters. Um, plot it out first. She says donuts for everyone, I agree. Anne Marie, you can absolutely have ice cream for breakfast. I said it was okay, but only once in a while because, you know, you don't want to overdo it. Um, let's see. Okay, Nani I think says, I got them all. Nani Davis says, good morning. First time we're here. Good morning. Welcome, Nani. We're happy you're here. Erica says, allergies are kicking my butt. I sneezed all night and now my nose hurts and my throat. Hope I don't have a cold. Oh, oh Erica, I'm so sorry. Oh, that's allergies are terrible. They're bad right now. They're bad. Have a nice cup of hot tea with a little bit of honey. That'll help your throat, sweetie. Faye, this is my first time watching your stream, and I'm so excited to be here. Oh, I'm so excited you're here too, Thank Faye. You. Nice to meet you. Just an ordinary writer says hi there. Hello. Sam says the background is a nice choice. Thanks. I hope so. I hope it comes out okay. Juliana says, your hair journal is by far my favorite of your work. I love how they all extend to the next page. Oh, thank you. It is kind of fun. I am also live. DVM draw with me says. <laughs> yeah, I worked from free. Exactly. Um, do you use, <sighs> trying to move the comments. Do you use watercolor paints or watercolor palettes? Uh, I use paints from the tube. I have the, the little little uh, palette things for when I travel, though. Oh, here's a good one. I don't know if you've done this one yet. Um, I don't have the Wi-Fi password asks, hi again, just curious, have you done a video on how to do creases and shadows in clothing? Yes, folds. Yeah, have it's, you done that? Yeah, I haven't. I mean, there's an older one on YouTube, but I'll, I'll update it, but it's another JC Lion Decker uh. thing. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. Um, I couldn't remember if you'd done that. Um, probably because we've done so many videos. Good morning from Austin, Texas. That's Charlie. Well, hello. Um, May Sam says hello. Hello. I love drawing, but I'm never really good at it. It says Chi. Oh, if you love it, you'll get better oh, at it. Oh, if you love it, you just do it. You do it because you love it. Yeah. And remember, it's not a competition. Um, Robo Ryoko says, Hey Scott, do you have any tips on how to blend watercolors in scenery paintings? Uh, blend watercolors in scenery paintings. Mm -hmm. Um, it depends on the type of blending that you do. Like I like to dry between each, uh, color. I don't like my colors to blend, but so, most watercolor artists like to do kind of a wet on wet where their colors just kind of blend together. So really just depends on your style. If you want them to blend, then just keep the keep the paper very wet as you're doing it. Um, Sleeping Alpaca, which by the way is a great name. I love that. It says, love your studying the master series. Thank you. Bob, it was fun. Bob Boop says, congrats on 100,000 on YouTube. Last I checked, you had 99. Thank you. Erica says, April 6th, I will get my postcards of my sunflower. She's going to sell them and donate half the proceeds. That's, That's wonderful. great, Erica. You know I'm there. In my country, it's evening now. Well, good evening to you. Theo says, you are so awesome, and good morning. You are awesome, and thank you. David says, my mini breakfast tortas were amazing. Had to have eggs. Sorry, Donna. Oh. Yeah. You know what? I want everybody to enjoy eggs because I can't have them. Oh, Scott, he's over on TikTok and he says hello. Hey, Scotty, good morning. Good morning, friend. Kiss the puppies for me, how are you? Lily 
Jack says, okay, running to Michael's. Yeah, bring your coupon. If you have a coupon that will give you a discount on clearance and sales stuff too, bring a coupon. I mean, what the heck? Nina the Greyhound says, I was here yesterday. You are my favorite YouTuber. You are so good at art and inspiring. You are very nice. That Thank you very so sweet. much. Aurora said, good afternoon in Italy. It's 3.35 p.m. Good afternoon. And Aurora, I wish I was sitting next to you at a little cafe in Italy and we were either having <laughs> espresso or a nice glass of wine since it's 3.35 in the afternoon. Um, you're so talented. Brooke says, question, when using stencils, do you feel or get told you are tracing? For that reason, I feel put off for using stencils, but they are just so beautiful and fun. Uh, here's the thing. I trace all the time. Tracing is, there's nothing wrong with tracing. Every professional artist traces. So if someone tells you you're tracing, say thank you. Yes, I'm tracing. <clears throat> there's nothing wrong with it. I think people just want to have an opinion. Yeah. They try to make other people feel bad for what they're doing. Yeah. And you don't have to ever feel bad about you don't. anything that you're doing. You trace... When you need to. You do you. I trace all the time. Those those 60 days of uh, studying the masters, most of those I traced. You know why? Because it is very hard to do one of those every single morning. Mm -hmm. So to save time, I traced some, or I traced most of them. There's nothing wrong with it. It didn't affect the fact that I was still making art. Mm -hmm. Trace. Yep. Go and have fun and learn. Mm -hmm. When I have to do... Um, <clears throat> A professional thing and I say I've got to do like a Star Wars or Star Trek or Harry Potter or something like that and it's for a client and they want it to look just like the actor you darn right you tra you trace every artist does it so don't let people tell you that it's wrong he never cleans his stencils and he gets them at either the art store or Michaels David says, good morning. Good morning. All right. Oh, Samantha's here. She says, Ada just woke up and wants to say hello, Mr. and Mrs. Crackers. And <laughs> hi, Wolf and Belly Rose to Arwen. Oh. Hello. Tell Ada we said hi. Hi and good morning. Okay. I think we're ready for some watercolors. What do you all think? Let's do the background first. Let's find a nice color for it. Code Blue says, hi, I'm currently packing things to move while listening to this. That is my least favorite thing to do, is pack. I wish you luck and good luck and Godspeed because I hate packing. Packing for a trip? Yes. Packing to move? No. Zorro fan says, hey, most of me says, wow. Uh, mac and cheese, which is just really funny, um, says, hello, your art is so good. I'm always scared, says, hi, am I late? You are not late. You're not late. Scott just did the background. He did most of the inking of the hair yesterday. So now we're going to paint. Well, I'm not going to paint. You don't want me to paint. I paint walls. I don't paint art. Um, Curieri says hello. Hello. Hey, Fiber and Brimstone says, good morning. Made it through my first week at the new job. Happy to be able to listen to the live again. Oh, well, welcome. We're happy you're here, Elvin. It's Van Z Cat says, yay. Many people in the world have a talent to draw. They do. I think some people um, just... They don't pursue it. They don't pursue it. And I think other people maybe turn them off to it by telling them silly things like don't copy and don't use a stencil. Okay, so let's look. So we have uh, kind of like a, a grayish blue and green for a background. We have like a magenta and yellow for a background. We have... Kind of like a reddish and yellow. We have gray, uh, purplish and teal. We have rust, or yeah, rust and teal. So let's stay away from those, so we can do something original. Um, Tyranno says good morning from Rivendell. Good morning. Nina the Greyhound says wow. Uh, we usually stream at around nine a.m. ish Central Time. Um, can you do me a favor, please? You need a tissue? Um, well, yes, I need a tissue. But also, could you scan that really quickly before we paint it? Oh, thank you. My yes. wife reminded me to scan it. No, I didn't. Bethany reminded me and I reminded you. Thank you, Bethany. There you okay, go. well, then, um, here. Give us two seconds. Look at that piece while I do that. <laughs> um, 
Um, internet experts says, finally, the time zone difference makes it very hard to watch your streams. Tax Frog says, hi, I love your drawing and your series inspired me to study the works of other people and saw great progress and different habits that I picked up. I even applied for art school and got accepted. Congratulations. Oh my gosh, that's fantastic. We are so proud of you. Yay, good for you. Wow, that's so beautiful. I love the way the hair looks. Dina says, love your work. Love you as a human being, by the way. I've oh. never been to India. No. no. That I was, was writing and directing a film. Oh, that we might have had to go, but yeah. that ended up fizzling. You're so good. Keep it up 100%. I watch every stream. That's Nina the Greyhound. Thank you. Samantha says, Ada wants me to tell you she has started her first poster board art. Today will be her fourth day doodling it. She has been inspired by you. Thanks, Scott, so much. No, thank you. Thank tell you, Ada I would like to see progress of the poster, please. <clears throat> Blair says, hello, this is my first time watching you live. Your tips are amazing. I'll be a freshman in college next year. I hope I get to draw and paint despite of it. Thank you for being talented. Thank you so much. That's very kind of you to Blair, say. Blair, you just have to take a sketchbook and put it in your backpack. And in between your classes, you just need to sketch. You just need to make time. When Bring your sketchbook when you're eating in the dining hall and sketch then. You just have to do it. Um, you should do a drawing hands for 60 days challenge. <laughs> you are a mean, mean person. <laughs> oh God. Now we're Sarah says, I want to go to art school. I should practice every day, but I am not. What should I do to form the habit? Look, if you're going to make art, it's, it's like anything else. If you love something, you're going to keep wanting to do it. So if you find that you're not going back to art, then maybe art isn't what you really want to do. If you catch yourself singing more, then maybe you really want to sing, or maybe you want to act, or maybe you want to dance. Or, but I found, at least growing up, they couldn't keep me away from drawing. And so it was like, you had to send me to art school. So that's what, what I would be looking for is what is that thing that you do that you always want to do? That's it. Don't force yourself to make art. If you're forcing yourself to make art, then that's maybe not really what you want to do. And, and being an artist is not something that pays a lot. So it's not like, oh, I really got to work hard at this. It's not really something I would like. If you're going to, if you're like, hey, I'm going to do something I really don't like to do, then do something that uh, is going to make you money, is what I'm saying. Otherwise, pursue what you love, but make um, sure you love it. Iggy Eyebrows, I've got to go, but I just wanted to say this now. You two come across as genuinely the sweetest people ever. Happy drawing, and I hope everyone has a great day. Thank you very much. That was very much. sweet, Iggy. I'm always scared. It says, what would be a good place to start realistic drawings if you're a beginner? I just posted something. Are you? Uh, I don't know if you just saw the, the video that I just posted literally half an hour ago. Um, Juliana says, this piece makes me feel like fresh spring. Scorpion says, morning, everyone. Lily says, Donna, trust me when I say I know you love those coupons. Hey, look, let me tell you, why would you pay more if you can use a coupon? Why? That's all I'm saying. Tom says, hi from the UK, love all the good work. Hello. Stefner says, black label, gold label, coffee. Decisions, decisions. That depends <laughs> on how late you were up. If you were up really late, I would start with coffee, then go to black label, then go to gold label. All right, we are scanned. Ada tells everyone I trace because my best friend, Mr. Crackers, tells me so. Good. Oh. 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 She's killing me. Tracing is how you learn to draw, and it's also how you get stuff right when you have a client that needs it done absolutely yeah. perfect. And as a sharks girl says, oh, fancy seeing you here, Donna. Yeah, I know, right? Oh, here. I got this for you. Oh, thank you so much. Appreciate that. Um, Sven Shiza says, I've been watching your shorts a lot of time. Tracing is okay. However, it should not be confused with copying. The lines are a thing, but they are there. I aspire your artistic style, though. So soft. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, uh, again, I just did 60 days of studying or copying the masters. Um... That's how artists learn is by copying other artists. So keep that in mind. I think what people mistake is the difference between copying art, which is good, and copying art and claiming that that is yours. So if I was to like copy a Norman Rockwell and say, I came up with this, 
that is bad. But saying, I copied a Norman Rockwell, that is good. I hope that makes sense. Okay, there are so many comments I'm so behind on. I'm gonna go to the bottom and work my way back up. I okay. apologize. Graphite Smile says hello. Kappa says hi. Hello. Is it still fun to make art every day? And will you find it fun in the future? It is for me. I, I, I find it fun and I enjoy it. Say hi to Lily. Hi, Lily. I haven't had coffee all week. Aside from Monday, something's definitely wrong with me. Anne Marie, seriously, caffeinate girl. Hello, how did you get better at creating backgrounds and landscapes? Um, I, what I did was I, I, I started going out into the wild and just drawing places. So um, just just sketch everything that you see and you start to get better at it. But I was always really bad at backgrounds until I did it more. Squid Squitterton says, hi, I was hitting an art block in your work and tips really helped me get back on track and draw more. You're really inspiring and such a kind person. Thank you so much for everything you do. Thank um, you. Imagine fish talent is just five to 10% and practicing your talent will give you the real thing. You have to practice, practice, practice. Yeah, yeah. Um, let's see, how long are you drawing? Like how many years? Uh, maybe about 40 something years. Sometimes I think I try to draw meticulously, but I find expressive art is much more fun. Oh my God, I love your art so much. Also, this is my favorite Oops. live. What was that? It's just a ruler. Oh, scared me to death. Oh, it's okay. No one's coming out to get you. Maybe you could make the background pink, purple, or blue turquoise. Yeah, I have a lot of turquoise, so I'm going to go with a little bit of orange. Nina says you are so Let's talented. See. Donna thank is you. not talented, but thank you. You're cute. Once you start drawing every day and building the habit, it will just come naturally. How about drawing eyes for 60 days? <laughs> Gee, let's see. Uh, I really like your art. I am not an artist, but thank you for asking. I'm excited to get back into drawing and painting. It's my biggest passion. That was Mei Mei. What an amazing style. I mean, just truly amazing. That was plasma. That's very a nice cool of you. The hair journal could be a bald Viking man with a long epic beard. That sounds cool. We've been trying to get him to do a beard picture. I'm hoping maybe tomorrow will be Santa Sunday with a beard. And I think tomorrow's the start of uh, 30 people who made the world a better place. Really? Yeah. <sighs> You're We're going to have to take a break from this because That's I... Cool. Let's see. Um, Black Phoenix, love y'all's enthusiasm for your followers. Good news. <laughs> well, why not? I love the... You know, everybody deserves a little pat on the back and we don't get that as adults, you know? Um, I am painting with watercolors while watching. Oh, fantastic. Um, everybody's like, congrats on getting into art school, yeah. That's so good. Um, I have a question. Do you ever plan to take your sketches, plan out your sketches, or do you prefer to be spontaneous and just go where it takes you? I plan a theme. So I have a Lord of the Rings sketchbook. I have This Is My Hair Journal. Um, so I theme them, but I don't have like, I'm going to do this drawing on this day kind of thing. Maria says, just watch Animal Crackers. I loved it. You're one of my favorite YouTubers and you made me feel confident about my art. Oh, that makes me so happy. Thank you. I'm so happy oh. that you like the film too. Good thing Phoenix is here. I switched to a computer so much better. Um, let's see. Everybody's talking about background colors and stuff. I never, he's just gonna do what he's gonna do. I would trace black outlines and coloring books during my three years in middle school, sixth to eighth grade. It would help loosen up my hand and a good warm up. That's a good idea. That is Who a good is idea. talking? Um, Subway Surfers, my name is Donna, and I would be guilty of being Scott's wife for almost 30 years. Oh, Santa's here. Congratulations on 108,000. Oh, thank you, Santa. Do you have any tips for high school portfolios? Um, yeah, I, I would say uh, show some diversity in what you do. Show people, places, things. Show different types of people, places, and things. Um, Stay away from just drawing anime or comic stuff. That's the kind of stuff that I did. Uh, that'll help you get into art school. <laughs> Jamie Brown says, that's some Tennessee orange there. <laughs> yeah. Sleeping Alpaca says, your art inspires me so much. Thank you. While packing things, I found an empty notebook that has nice paper for watercolor. Yay. Ooh. I've only had cheap sketchbooks, so I'm happy. There you go. I just wanted to say that Aaron Blaze has a free trial on his website, 500 hours of free drawing lessons. That's a good idea. Oh, that's idea. cool. Aaron Blaze is incredibly talented. This chat is so wholesome. I love watching your lives. It brightens my day. Oh, crap. See, I already went over onto the, uh, what was the name of the flower? Hibiscus. Hibiscus. Mm. 
Um, let's see. Sorry, I cursed. Um, Tyrannial says, I just know that tracing is actually, it's different to actually copying it and claiming that it's yours. But tracing is how we learn. Yeah. Um, let's see. I love that Code Blue found a good sketchbook when you were packing. I love that finding things like, it's like finding $20 in your coat pocket from last year. It's great. Um, currently watching this with my mom in the sun. Oh, nice. Um, hey, so I've been making art for a while. And what would you say is the best way to practice? Um, the best way to practice. Mm -hmm. I like filling up sketchbooks because you can keep track of your progress. So you can look back from sketchbook to sketchbook. You can see from the previous pages, uh, the good ones and the bad ones, because uh, most of them are going to be bad. And you need to you need to own up to that and just acknowledge that. Guy from Friday says, good morning, Saba citizens of YouTube. Good morning. Uh, meow art is cute. How, I have a question. How are you guys doing? You're very sweet. Oh, thank you. We are doing good. We are doing very well. Thank you. I hope you are doing well too. Tell us how you're doing. Zafrina says, that's so cool. Looks like another great drawing for the hair collection. Amazing. That's um, Sarasaurus. Oh, thank would you. Would you say Leonardo da Vinci would be in those 30 days? Whoa! What did you do now? The cap came off. Uh-oh. Yep. Well, guys, <laughs> you're seeing, um, wow, th that's in the wild. I mean, you want to talk about the wild guys. That is ink too. That is ink. Yep. <laughs> well, paper towels, honey, paper towels. Yeah. I would also wash your hands. But that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> You guys, this is funny. I think they're all gonna freak. Oh, look at them all. Oh no, shit, oops, oh no, oops, yes, oh no, oh no. Is this now abstract? Is that fixable? New art style, oh no. Oh, well, we'll Maybe find out. Maybe you something abstract. Whoa, didn't know you were making modern art. Okay, you don't need to read everyone. Okay, I got I it. I think these are funny. Are the other pages safe? I don't yeah. know. Yeah, the other pages are fine. Um, you guys, this yeah. happens. It happens. You know what? This is what we're calling like painting in the wild. Um, painting like you never know what you're gonna get with us. So now we will watch Scott fix this beautiful painting <laughs> to the best of his ability because stuff happens, guys. Right? Stuff happens. Life happens. Yeah. Right, here's what we're doing. Um, we do have a spreadsheet for people who will be making the world a better place and we have to go through we have a ton of people who were suggested um, and um, yeah so how long does it usually take you to paint a background well we're gonna find out aren't we <laughs> I'm a bit sticky now yep 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 Sam says, I watched Animal Crackers before I found you on YouTube, and I loved it. I recently found you and found that you and your wife made the movie. I watched the movie with my mom. We love it. Oh, oh thank you. So great. Windsor and Newton watercolors, Squid Squidgerton. There's a link in his bio to those. Oh, boy, guys. I don't know what he's going to do, but we're going to get to watch and see. Um... Ma of the Valley says, I accepted my bad drawings and now all I do is badly draw an orange cat and he is now my stable. <laughs> I love it. Um, you guys, I think everybody is just shocked on what's going on. I'm half asleep on the couch because of my allergies, but Erica says, LOL from what just happened. Toned canvas. <laughs> you guys, I, yeah. you know Let's blow dry it. Sometimes See. life, right? Executor says, looks good. <laughs> Melissa says, well, use it, I guess. Ha ha. Yep. Scott looks like he murdered the Cheeto tiger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Aiden's here. Aiden says, can 
Congrats on 100,000. Thank okay, you. Okay, guys, I need a small favor. There's a lot of you here. This, see, um, I'm going to call him Gooey, but it's, it's Goo High. But it's Gooey, right? Go and do me a favor and give him a follow. This is my little friend, Aiden. He is the son of a very dear couple who's a friend of mine. And he makes art. And he's 14 years old. Okay. And just give him a follow. Blow dryer. Right? Just blend the paint before the paint gets dry. It looks like it's going to be a gouache painting, says Richard. It, it very well might be, but let's see what we can do. Honey, why don't you go upstairs and wash your hands real quick? I don't think it's going to come out, honey. It's ink. Okay. No turning back. Yeah. I'm guessing you're going to use a wash now instead of watercolor. Blubber! I was going to ask you to make a tutorial on how to keep hands clean while painting. Now is the best time, Scott, <laughs> to show us your hands clean cleaning routine. Oh, geez, Louise. Nina, the answer to your question is yes. Um, what are you going to do with the hair color now? We're going to watch. Well, the hair color is probably going to be a darker <laughs> color. Aiden which says is... he has committed to being a Cheeto. Indeed, he has for at least a week. The ink will not come out. Santa says tomorrow's video will include what pen is that and why is your hand orange? Yeah. <laughs> You know what? Maybe Donna will do a video of how to get ink off of Scott's hands. <laughs> I think you know by now. It's, it's there. It's not going to come out. I know, because I I had ink. Remember, I gave um, Owen all those inks for his birthday yeah. in October, and the ink didn't come off of my hands. We were on seeing my nephew, and the ink didn't come off my hands for at least three weeks. <laughs> oh, God. This is great. I love this. I mean, I love you. I'm not, I'm not, you know, laughing at you, but I think it's funny. Oh, you guys. Brittany Woman says, don't worry, Scott. You're a wizard and can fix it. <laughs> Jill Rosenbaum says, imagine someone asking him why his hands are orange. Scott, it's complicated. It's complicated. You should see the other guy. <laughs> you should see the other <laughs> You should see the other guy. That's great. Um, but this is... I, I know it sounds silly, but this is what I love about traditional art. Um, a lot of my paintings, similar stuff happen, and then, you know, you come up with, it's like, like Bob Ross used to say, happy little accidents. So who knows? Maybe this piece will be, become my favorite piece now. Oh, this is so funny. Um, please answer this. What about depressed people where you lose interest in things you loved like crazy? Um... I, I can't speak for artists who make art through depression, you know, or they, they kind of express their feelings. That's just not how I am. Um, I, what I will say is, um, for me, making art keeps me from being depressed. It, it makes me happy. So find what it is about making art that makes you want to make art and focus on that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Squid Squidderton says, you should just ink the rest of your hands orange and pretend it's a genetic mutation. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was great though. <laughs> Nina says, you should be in a Cheetos advertisement. <laughs> or the Doritos ones. Oh God, being a Cheeto is the style, don't you know? I mean, I just, I'm sorry. I'm enjoying this at your expense, and I said, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, Pinky says, ooh, 100 people watch it. Yeah, 100 people watched you spill ink all over. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I got this. Oh, I'm really happy with the uh, with the inking. Yeah. Thank you, Bethany, for reminding me to scan it. Oh, God, right? Lordy. Scott is discovering a new style. His next sketchbook will need to use this as David Ketcher side. Oh, God. Sam says, my tummy hurts and it's so worth it. Everybody's laughing. Emma says, rubbing alcohol is highly effective at removing ink stains from your skin. All you can do is pour a little in your hands and rub your hands together until the ink stain washes away. We may have to try. 
Richard says, this will be the best painting in the sketchbook. It's funny how things work. Yeah. Oh, God. You guys. Ada said that your hands are orange from eating fish crackers. <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh, God. This is, I'm sorry. I'm enjoying this. Um, Santa says, it's always interesting when people say, I'm not laughing at you, I'm laughing with you. But Scott was not laughing. <laughs> he wasn't. But I'm enjoying this at his expense. I, you know, I... But here's the funny thing. I've watched him for so long. No, it's funny because it, I heard that in Morgan Freeman's voice, yeah. but Scott was not laughing. <laughs> <laughs> the narrator. <laughs> the narrator voice. Uh, Aiden says, I drew the red panda from Turning Red and I'm uploading it to YouTube today. <gasps> Yay! I have to check it out. I love that red panda. Rose says, happy little accidents. Not sure that's what Bob Ross meant, but go for it. <laughs> Julie says, my perfectionist attitude would not allow me to to somewhat enjoy accidentally making messes on my drawing. My anxiety and dread would be through the roof. Oh, you know what? Here's the thing, and I, I, I hope you guys just remember this, is it's just a piece of paper. It's just a sketchbook. I could tear it out if I really hated it, or I could just turn the page. That's all. It's just a piece of paper. And I think when, when artists finally realize that they can throw their work away or they can just toss it aside or they can move on or they can just live with the mistake they become a little more chill about it it's it's we're not brain scientists you know we're not saving lives or anything we're just making art so i think uh lower the stakes a little bit Sometimes all you can do is laugh in deep, yeah. right? A hundred of us are traumatized to David Ketcher's eyes. <laughs> oh God. Rose, Scott, could say he was trying out self-tanning lotion again. Oh gosh. Oh, was that so awesome? <laughs> For those of you who don't know, I was like, what about Eight, a year, a year, a year into the pandemic, I was like, "Oh my God, I haven't seen the sun in forever. Look at how t how light my skin is. Oh, I'm usually much more tan." So, I th I thought, "Okay, well, let me try tanning lotion." And I tried a little bit on my hand, and my hand looked so <laughs> dark; it was so obnoxious. Yeah. And so, for a good oh, few yeah. weeks, I had to explain to everybody what I had done. Let's see. I'm loving the collective wholesome jokes the chat was making. Brittany Woman says, Scott, I tuned in right at the moment of the spillage and thought you did it on purpose. I was like, wow, this is the rock star message this morning. Wow. Yeah, performance art. Mental X Big Mac says, hi, how are you both doing? We're good, we're thank good. you. How are you? You're the modern version of Bob Ross. We're not made of magic. We're made of practice. It's <laughs> Kip Larson. Scott, orange, you glad you made on this day. Laura, oh, that was geez. great. That was great. I love that one. That was the best one so far. Ash Tunes, do you ever feel like you're cheating by using a stencil for the background when you didn't actually draw it? No. no. You didn't draw it. No, I didn't draw the stencil, honey. No, but no, you're it's not cheating. the stencil. Yeah, no, yeah. That's what the stencil's there for. That's what tracing paper is for. That's what uh, uh, projectors are for. It's to help you get your art done. So there's no such thing as cheating. Willow asks, um, loving oranges, what brush are you using? Uh, this is just a travel brush that I, I got. There's a link to it in my bio. They're uh -huh. kind of indestructible at this point. Aiden says, are you ready to get your play button plaque? I, I, I guess so. I don't know. I mean, someone's going to have to reach out to get my address <laughs> at some point, <laughs> but yeah. More art anxiety says, how interesting it would be if Morgan Freeman, Freeman narrated Scott's lives. Now, are you saying I'm not doing a good job? Come on, I'm not feeling the love now. I bet I can use your favorite animal. Is it a red panda? Indeed it is. If there was one person I would not want to uh, narrate my life, it would be Donna. So. Really? Oh, yeah. Yeah. The you amount of snark. The amount of snark that would be in that narration. I don't know what you're talking about. This is perfect to listen to while I study for my exams. Um, Avi Regenfish says, I have to go see you. All right, bye. Have um, a great and day. Bob says, I need to go, but can't wait to watch this tomorrow. Sam says, Ada said, if um, they ask, just say I ate an old animal cracker and it didn't work quite well. <laughs> we could 
could just pretend the person got paint in their hair. Is that what happened? Missy Fishy says hello. Jamie says, you can always print your scan and do version two. That's true. Yeah, we'll make this one work. Um, wise words, we're making art, no need to raise the stakes. Fiber and Grimson says, when I'm stuck, I purposely make bad art to throw away and just play. Helps get over the blank page anxiety. <laughs> What's going on here? Well, we're laughing that we dropped the ink. Um, oh, um, he scanned in the piece before he colored it. So, like on a scanner, computer scanner. I'm spooky. Uh, when did you have the idea to upload your art to the internet? Oh, You've been um, it for years. yeah, I've been doing it probably for 20 years now. Mm -hmm. um, if you go to deviantart.com, plus there's a link in my bio, you'll see some really old art. Yeah. Hi, Scott. I just discovered your amazing art channel and I'm so inspired. That was Willow Rose. Thank you very much. It's very nice to meet you. Randy says, lower the stakes. I like that. Charlie O says, no hands were harmed in the making of the piece. <laughs> oh, she said he was going to turn into the animal cracker, but it only gave him the color instead. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out how to put this into the video for tomorrow when I... Mary says, just discovered this channel and it has rekindled my passion for watercolor. For my birthday in a little over a week, I'm hoping to get some new watercolors and brushes. Thank oh, wonderful. Wonderful. Thank you. Ada is now coming up with excuses for Scott and I'm losing it with laughter. This has made my day. <laughs> Steph Nerd says, Scott, I'm the color of a ghost. I'll always be a ghost. <laughs> well, I am half Middle Eastern, so I'm used to having a little bit darker skin. But Sam says, Ada has just, a Ada said she has learned that tracing is just a form of practice makes perfect. Yeah. Okay, I am now proud of her. Oh. <laughs> Unfortunately, Lebanese says, I went out to buy chocolates and now I'm back. You seem like you don't like charcoal. Um, no, I have nothing against charcoal. Oh, thanks, Emma. Rose, and you did that self-tanning adventure while Donna was visiting her mom in California. That's what happens when you're left unsupervised. <laughs> yeah, but this is what happens when he's left supervised. I'm sitting right here. Oh, gosh. Your narrative skills are top tier. I'm doing my best. What's your favorite color? Payne's gray. Kip says from... And definitely orange. not orange. Not orange. <laughs> sure not anymore. From my understanding, you have to apply to get your play button. Oh, interesting. Really? They're going to make me go after it? No. Some see happy little accident, others see an opportunity for content. Sam is laughing. As terrestrials would make a cool movie. Thank That's you. That's the next one in the queue, Aiden. After Pet Robots, Lindsay says hi. Hello. Um, what was your favorite art style as a kid? Oh, comic books. I was huge into comic books. Ada's asking, have you thought about making a colored book? Well, yeah, we've been talking about it, and since I, um, um, since I'm scanning these in, I guess that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Stafford, I'm sorry, Scott, but my brain keeps telling me you went crazy on a um, on a puffed Cheetos bag. <laughs> the background looks is looking really well. Thank um, you. It's me. Olivia says hello. Hello. Um, good night. I'm here to drop a like. Please Thank you. The spillage in the final video. <laughs> I will. I will. I want the music to kind of stop as I spill. Your and... art is so inspiring. Thank you. Um, is that Alexa speaking? Hello. <laughs> this is Alexa reading the comments. Um, oh, great. Now you're turning this thing on. Stop it. <laughs> um, Kim Opie says, if you need an inspiration, I've started a collection of animals wearing clothes. Oh, thank you. David says, I think a record scratch when the ink splashes and then a change in song and tempo would be great Thanks. for the video recap. Aiden says, I've been a fan since 900 subs. Oh, thank you. Aiden is one of our original likes and viewers here. I'm eating Cheetos right now and my hand looks just like yours, so don't worry, you're not the only one. <laughs> Donna, I ordered some scones from Amazon. I didn't realize it came with six boxes. I'm gonna make it this morning. I'm so excited. I even ordered clotted cream. Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. You have to tell me how you like it. Um. Yeah, oh, that was. Julie is is heading out. Bye, Julie. Bye. 
I feel more alive now that I've eaten time for cookies and stuff. Nerd. I'm gonna draw and play your guys' stream in the background. That would Thank be you. Art. Lily says the background, Lily Jack says the background is looking really nice. Thank you. Mental X Big Mac retracted a message. <gasps> Scandalous. Mm -hmm. Gigi the chicken says hi. Hello. I guess you can say you're a Tennessee fan at the bracket chatter now. <laughs> Go Vols. The background is looking really well regardless. Mental X says I rewinded the live to see the, the ink accident. I had a heart attack. Ugh. Where can I watch the stream from TikTok? Uh, it should be just, just find me as Saba Art, uh, and you'll see I'm live right now. Jamie says, orange is one of my favorite colors, and I end up with food coloring on my hands all the time. <laughs> Caden says, I love your videos. You are amazing and inspiring to keep it up. That is very nice of you to say. Thank you. Pratyaksha says, hey, I've often heard you talk about your live drawing sessions on your chats, but I've never been able to watch them in real time. Glad to finally be able to do it. I love your videos. I'm glad you did. Thank you. You just missed me spilling orange ink all over the entire painting. <laughs> I wouldn't but... say we missed it, Bob. Uh... Willow says, oh my goodness, a hair journal colored book would be so cool. Scott finally found his least favorite color for now. Yeah, for Aiden says, if you line up all the Cheetos that have been said in this chat, it could make it halfway to the nearest star. <laughs> oh, God. Orange hearts. Alexander says, hello. Hello. Uh, how to two says, hello. Ada is asking Mr. Crackers, when you go out to create art, do you forget people are around you like she does? Yeah, yeah. Especially if I put my headphones on, I'm in my own little, little world. David Ketcherside says, now I really feel the need to paint today. Um, one benefit of YouTube, I could scroll back to see the accident. I was listening to it, but missed what happened in the live. That's true. Aurora, oh my god, I got back to the live a second ago. My first reaction was, OMG, <laughs> how beautiful. <sighs> Did you hear my finger stick to the paper? Yes. yes. All right. Says, at least it wasn't a dark blue or something you could could work with as easy. Um, have you ever wanted to quit art and drawing, and why? Um, yeah, when I spilled orange all over this, I wanted to quit art and drawing. <laughs> Say, I just shared your work with my mom, who is a hairdresser and an artist. She absolutely loved your hair journal. If you were to make a colored book, I would buy it in an instant. Oh, thank you. Have you ever spilled paint or ink on your painting before? You mean before today? Um, yes, yeah. But I, not this bad I, that I've seen, and I've been around a long time. <sighs> what are you going to do for the color of the flower? Uh, I don't know. What color is it? Was it yellow? It was a yellow, yes. Okay, um, let me... Do you want to go wash your hands? No, it's not going to make a difference. Okay. <laughs> Red Sir Mouse says, gotta go, but I drew the border for my notes in orange in your honor. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, I'm spooky. Just call it abstract and call it a day. Steph Nerd, Scott, go wash your hands. The color won't be removed, but it won't be sticky. Oh, that's fine, it's fine. Oh. I'm, gonna try, I'm gonna try brown and see if that is gonna make it, no. I don't really know if brown's the, the right choice here. I think I'm gonna go with this. Um... What platform is your podcast on? I don't have a pod. Oh, you mean the, the one I was the just one on? You did yesterday. I don't That's know. A good question. Hand sanitizer should help pull that off your hands. Donna I know, has plenty of that. <laughs> Oh God, I think the concept of it looks amazing, turning a mess into a beautiful painting. Pretty Woman says, this one is actually turning out really nice. She's gonna look so nice and tall and tan and lovely. I think we might have to go with a purple. What do you guys think? Because I don't think this is working either. Lily Jack says, pour one orange drink out in your honor, Scott. Meow, <laughs> can y'all give me a color I'm gonna do? Blow dryer. <laughs> Willow 
honestly, I missed the ink spill and thought the splatter would look was intentional. Just own it, it's looking great. Kim Obi says, Donna sounds like a former radio personality in my area and it really messes with my head sometimes. Wow. See, I always thought my voice was nasty, but maybe I could do things. Purple would look awesome. I'll be a radio DJ in the next life. And now the clock app is crashing. I think the internet's acting up. Oh, Steph, I'm sorry. It's beautiful here. Um, I'm live, my neighbor one gray color. Steph says purple. Yep, they're liking the purple. I am mixing. Ratty Sim says just joined, looking good. Thank you. Let's see here. Need a freaked out face when your ink spilled all over the paint. <laughs> oh, here we go, everybody. Here we go. The boats from TikTok are for purple or blue. Maybe you could turn that splatter on her neck into a small tattoo. Yeah, or birthmark. I don't know. Five hundred birthstones says blurple. Do you name your paintings? No. Purple would make sense with the brown undertones, maybe. Sam says, Ada said, no, Dom, your voice is very nice, like a petunia voice with a smile and a wink. Ah, oh, that's cute. <laughs> Ada remembers. That's adorable. Um, this is always working fine on her end. The Cheeto Cheetah as a human. Toxies is very cool drawing. Wow, that's so beautiful. Blurple. Everybody's calling it Blurple. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Are you going to keep her orange? No, I'll, I'll give her some pinks and, and whatnot. I'll try to make her look a little bit more natural. Do either of you have any tattoos? No. An excellent question. I do not have tattoos. Neck tattoo, also blurple. <laughs> Seems like it'll look like a galaxy. This is giving me a very tropical vibe. Cheeto, name of the painting, Cheeto Hibiscus. <laughs> <laughs> Richard says, that's awesome. A complimentary color over the orange, nice. Bethany says, I can hear Arvin snoring. Yeah. Do you sell sketchbooks or art supplies? No, we do not. No. No, but we have recommendations of what Scott uses in um, his uh, link in his bio. Um, what's your favorite movie? Uh, the Princess Bride. Beryl says looks nice. Sam says Ada is loving the hair. It reminds her of a jelly blood spill. She Now she wants a pink room chubby sandwich. Ada says as soon as I get to my dad's apartment, I'll upload the Red Panda video. Awesome. I know a caricaturist that made a mistake and forgot her marker, so she used color sticks. A few years later, she was awarded best color technique from an international competition for colored lines. Wow. That's cool. Cranberry Pie says, the colors look like a sunset to me. Do you have anyone who inspired you to do art? Yes, and I made a video on it. It's uh, the mosaic video from maybe four days ago, four or five days ago. says Topsy. Thank you very much. Requiem says it is night here. Meow Art says, oh, thank you. Um, what's your favorite book? The Hobbit. Blow dryer. Go to chat that I, I am not, uh, I don't have them at the ready. They're kind of uh, spur of the moment. 
Booble Bloom says, hair looks good as always. Oh, thank Decor you. Decor Creation says, so much hair. Um, Ada is asking, does Arwen like bananas like her puppy? Arwen does not like bananas. No, she does not. What um, piece of art are you most proud of? I think the Animal Crackers movie poster is the one I am the most proud of. I put a lot of time into it. I learned a lot. Um, and this is what it looks like. Ready Sim says, The Princess Bride is amazing. It's one of the reasons my brother is named Wesley. That's really cool. You have a brother named Wesley. It Liz says, I love how her hair looks multiple colors. It's like kind of a rainbow. I love it. It, it is kind of cool, huh? What's your favorite song? Oh, um, changes on each day, but I'll just, I'll say, uh, Woman in Chains by Tears for Fears. Kiwi says, I want to go to an art school, but for a few months now, I didn't have the motivation to draw since I started watching your videos. I felt so inspired and now I enjoy making art again. Thank you. Oh, thank you. That was Kiwi. Mm. Aiden, tell your mom, she and I can have a conversation about that. Um, Novia says, good evening. I'm late, but at least it's not like in like a few days ago. Yeah. Here's good a crazy evening. idea. Maybe do rainbow hair, like transition to turquoise and green and etc. Jamie says, Arwen is snoozing. Yuva says, you're so amazing. Love from Brazil. Thank you so much. Um, and Sav Cat says, animal crackers. <laughs> Aiden says, my dad's best dad joke is this. If you stand in a dark bathroom and say, Shamalan three times, then L, he, he will appear in the mirror. I don't even know what that means. Your dad has funky jokes. <laughs> I think it's a um, Michael Jackson thing, but I'm just not. What type of dog is Arwen? Oh, she is a rescue. She is, they think she's a beagle and a Jack Russell. And I found out yesterday she's considered geriatric because she's 10. Who knew there was actually a geriatric category it's... for dogs? Like I always just thought it was senior, but she's past senior and she's in geriatric. So there you she's go. She's gone to plaid. She's gone to plaid. <laughs> Oh, Michael Jackson joke. Gotcha. Um, what's your favorite thing to draw? And then what's your favorite thing to cook? My favorite thing to draw is hair. And my favorite thing to cook is pizza. Um, the rainbow hair reminds me of pigeon feathers, how they would look green or pink, depending on your perspective. New subscriber, loved your 60 days of studying the masters. You have inspired me to try watercolors again. Oh, Art thank you. Art was traumatic. Do you have a favorite architect or architectural design? I don't, I don't. Um, my favorite architectural design? Um, no, I don't. I mean, I love like old castles and stuff like that. Like Gothic architecture yeah, with windows? Gothic has like the flying buttresses and stuff like that. I'm not really that fan of that. I, I like more of the blow dryer. Hibiscus, um, yellow with red in the middle, okay. How did you find your love for art? Um, I, I had a, an, an artistic family, so my, my parents kind of just uh, encouraged it, which definitely helped. Richard says, she had this dry meat, more orange. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Oh God, um, Steph went for the Veracruz coffee instead. So good, mm -hmm, coffee. Just go outside says, good morning, my friends. Good morning. Abigail says, blow dryer. 
Um, pretty woman says that looks beautiful. David says Scott said buttresses. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, we're six. Um, Flying buttresses. Do you like drawing animals? If so, what's your favorite one to draw? I like drawing dogs and cats. She does. What's better to draw, people or places? People. Um, what's your favorite piece in this hair sketchbook? Um, I think it's this one. This one, so far. But who knows, this one might turn out to be my favorite since I splattered orange all over it. Uh, you're a wonderful artist, Scott. That was Nemesis. That's very you kind of you. have another gorgeous piece. It says Hazelnut. Oh, thank you. Um, what's your favorite kind of dog? Rescue. <laughs> yeah. Have you ever tried painting with coffee? No. He has done some tea staining of um, the matting for on pictures for me. Once. The woman reading this has such a calm voice. I could listen to it 24-7. Oh. That is very sweet. Blow dryer. Say goodbye to Jamie. Bye, Jamie. Um, that is a hibiscus flower. Um, Kelby says, wow, that's gorgeous. Thank you. Um, Stefford asks, wait, so with inks, you also go light to dark? Um, yes, yes. Scott does not play any instruments. Do you ever draw dogs? Yes. Only when I ask him, and only Arwen. No, I have done several. Um, Pretty woman says, ooh, that yellow is popping. What's your favorite color for hair? Orange. <sighs> it is. What's your favorite color of hair to draw and paint? Hair orange. That was back to back questions. Okay. Watching you paint is so satisfying. Oh, Just go you. outside, says Burmese Mountain Dog. That is a big dog. Pineapple on pizza, yes or no? No. Not particularly, no. 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 All right, time to break out the watercolors. To work with watercolor. Uh, yeah, I've been posting some, mm -hmm. uh, but work light to dark is the best one I can come up with. And if you look at his art hacks videos, you'll see it there. Ratty Sim says your thumb is very orange. It is. Blah Blah says, have you ever tried working with oil paints? I just found your channel a few days ago and fell in love with your amazing art. I am planning to always learn from you. Thank you. Um, I did in high school and I did not particularly like it, so. Tevin says, I have a feeling the coffee place must be a bit close to the vanilla place because it hasn't been a vanilla something in it and I added cinnamon. <laughs> Meow Art says, I find it funny the way he says blow dryer before he dries. People it's, wear AirPods and it's, yeah, it's, it's a just warning. to give them a heads up. I'm always scared of them dyeing my hair today and your art has inspired me to dye it purple. Oh, fantastic. I have purple in my hair too. Purple hair is the bee's the knees. Best. Do you prefer ink or watercolor? I, I like watercolor, but I've been just, it, I've been loving experimenting with ink until of course I spilled it all over my painting, but we'll see, we'll see. All right, let's see if we can get the face. What's your favorite hair texture to ink? Hair texture? Um, I like curls. I, I mean, I, I really had fun with this. Jill Rosenbaum loves chow chow dogs. Those are fluffy, so fluffy. Hey, Bells Not Whistles says morning. Good morning. Um, request from TikTok to show the reference photo. Oh, great. Thank you, Bethany. There you go. Can you do Celtic hair like Viking braids? Um, yeah, we're going to try. I just got to find the right yeah, photo. Yeah. Hi, Amaya. Is it be it's because the breed has mountain in its name. Ah, that's why you like it. And mountains are outside. Got it. I'm actually kind of liking her orangeness. I'm terrified of dogs. I'm sure you're really sweet though. It's her Guatemalanness. It's her Guatemalanness. Um, you know, do you need more water? I got some. I think. Okay. Um, she is very sweet, but I understand people being afraid of dogs. I've been bit twice in our neighborhood by dogs that people have just let be loose. So I, I do understand that. 
Jack Nielsen Rogers says, I have asked many questions and I want to thank you for responding to me. My pleasure. I hope we got to all of them. Um, Rin Wall says, actually the orange is making a neat effect in the hair. Aaron W says, I'm always too afraid to use a blow dryer on my art because I'm afraid the paint is going to splatter everywhere. Well, clearly the hair dryer doesn't splatter as much as dropping the thing of paint, so. Yeah, I, I would say I would say this. Um, if, you're, if you're worried about that, just use a little less water when you're doing it. It's the water that makes it uh, spray around. Um, Abigail says, what about crayons? Have you tried illustrations with crayons? I know it's random, but it seems fun. Yeah, when I was playing with the kids, you know, we would sometimes do that. It is kind of cute. Ice cream or cake? Um, cake doesn't bother me. I love ice cream, but cake doesn't bother me as much. Can I have both? Ice cream cake. What are you thinking of doing to the orange person? <laughs> well, we're gonna add a little bit of pink and see if any of it sticks. Finley has to go to bed because they're cycling with their dad tomorrow. Hope you have a great day. I hope you have do too. Have a good sleep and have a great time with your dad. Blow dryer. <laughs> Pencil. How do you guys feel about snow? It snowed here last night. Mary, we like snow. We're not opposed to snow, but we could not live in feet of snow. We are not let's dig ourselves out kind of people. Which makes Nashville appropriate because we get about maybe six inches at the absolute most and then it melts in a couple days. Hey! Mama Sora says, LMAO had to come over here and say hi to the Sava family and the SBC. Oh, thank you. What color are you going to make the eyes? I don't know. Oh. Thoughts? Should I just go with brown? I like brown. It's so muddy outside here, but we will still be going out, so just go outside. Yeah, your snow must be melting, and it's because it's spring. Huh? Blow dryer. <laughs> Thank you, Aiden. <laughs> you're so cute. Um, Mariah Chill says, I love the art. Keep doing what you're doing. Can't wait for the Celtic Viking art to come. Look, try looking through Viking TV shows. They have a lot of hair inspiration. Oh, thank you. I will. Wowie says, hello. I love the colors. Hello. Thank you. Um, have someone ever asked you to draw them, and does that annoy you? No, people ask me to draw them all the time. It doesn't annoy me. Um, I tried for a while uh, to to offer free portraits. Um, I kind of raffled them off and, and that was a lot of fun. I got to do some nice stuff. I felt like I was, you know, giving back a little bit, but um, yeah, it doesn't bother me at all. Che Robert Dean says, whoops, Kidlet and I got here too late. Waves from the DC area. Oh, hello. Internet says Martians. I don't know what that means. Just Martians. Who's your favorite fashion illustrator? His mom. Yeah, my mom was a fashion illustrator. Also, your hair journal is super beautiful. Thank Breath you. Breath of fresh air, and I just started back in and saw the ink splatter. Oh my God, you did such a good job fixing it. Glad <laughs> the purple hair suggestion worked with it. Thank you. I don't have the Wi-Fi password. It says, unfortunately, I must leave. Goodbye, and it looks amazing. Thanks Thank for you. streaming. Holy crap, that looks so cool. Bye. Have a wonderful day. Um, let's see. Do you have a favorite sketchbook that you draw in? Yeah, my travel ones I, I'm really happy with. Blow dryer.
Chris loves the twists and the curls in this, and um, Clown loves the curls too. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay. Um, his favorite color is Payne's gray, and Ashton says splatter paint randomly on purpose and then make it work. You might discover new techniques, and it's a great exercise. Yeah. It's Amaya says, love your art. Have a good day. Thank you. I'm Spooky asks, what are your biggest inspirations in drawing any particular artists? Uh, yes, I made a video on it, uh, the mosaic video. If you look, I posted it about maybe a week ago, and it kind of shows all of the, the artists and art that inspired me. Um, Brittany Woman says, make a pop of green for the eyes, which I think is nice. Green might be nice, yeah. What's your favorite type of carbs? Potatoes, bread, rice, or noodles? Bread. Bread, but I can't have it anymore. Um, Nina says, I'm in England right now. Nice, blow dryer. Okay, okay. Yeah, I get that. Our cousins up there say the same thing. Do you have a favorite? Oh, we answered that one. Um, Scott, well, Scott's hand looks like he's been eating way too many cheese doodles. <laughs> um, I had to leave and they came back. I thought the splatters were intentional. It looks cool, gives it an expressive vibe. Maybe it's fun to have spills more often. I say, you never know what you're gonna come up with. Blow dryer. Yeah. Um, Sunshine says, "Yeah, we're having another cold snap passing through, calling for snow off and on all next week." Wow. Um, say goodbye to Lily Jacks. Bye, Lily Jacks. Lily says, have a great day. I need to get going. I can't wait to see the miraculous save. <laughs> Thanks. Me too. What is your favorite food to draw and eat? My favorite food to draw is ice cream, and to eat is two-minute noodles. Ooh, that sounds good. I don't know if I have any. Hello there. I haven't. Just... What's wrong? I lost the comment. Mm. I know. I went to just kind of scroll a little bit, and it scrolled a lot. So now I'm irritated because I can't find the comment. Um, you did do a Van Gogh painting, didn't you? Yeah, day one of the uh, 60 Days of Studying the Masters. There we go. Um, what is your movie? Animal Crackers. It's on Netflix. <laughs> Um, hello there says, I haven't laughed in a while. This live made me laugh. Oh, thank you. Blow dryer. All right, now we're going to play around with some Kelby. colored pencils. Kelby says, I love how you care so much about your audience that you give them disclaimers when you want to try your audience. Oh. <laughs> um, all right, let's see. She's looking so good. You're amazing. Suddenly curious, but what are you two zodiacs? Um, I'm a Libra. I am a Sagittarius. Um, my cat is having a birthday party today. <laughs> That's wonderful. Happy birthday to your kitty. I know it depends on your mood, but you should have a crazy mohawk for another day. That's probably something, yeah. Um, my Sam, May Sam that says I have to go have a good day. Have a wonderful day. Do you ever practice drawing random people in a public place and then get caught? If so, how do you handle it? <laughs> no, no. Um, 
No, no one's really ever come up to me like when I'm sketching them and said, hey, are you sketching me? Like no one's ever done that. Yeah. Um, came across your channel last night and I'm in love with your work and love your love for your work. Thank you so much. Abigail says, why? Oh, um, the yeast. I'm allergic to the yeast in bread. Um, Kim Opie says, my son loves art and drawing but thinks he isn't good enough to call his work art. Any advice? I've tried to expose him to all kinds of art and I'm beginning to think it's more a confidence issue. Um, yeah, every artist feels, I, I do, I feel like I'm not good enough too. Um, I think uh, having that lack of confidence is actually not a bad thing to a degree um, because you always want to know that every artist is always trying to improve, always trying to get better at their craft. Um, so if they feel like they need to keep improving, that's a good thing. That just means that they're going to get better and better and better. If they're not enjoying making art, that's a problem. Um, Judah says, I love the artwork, but I would love to know what tips you give to future artists. Draw every day, draw everything every day. Dan Veer Mira, Isn't, aren't Emma and Bethany great? They're answering tons of questions for me. Oh. They're helping today a lot. And I appreciate them so very much. Sarah says, I'm late, but the drawing looks amazing. Thank you. Um, what artists have you currently been taking inspiration from? Uh, n no one currently. Uh, I think I've been so focused on my own art that I haven't really had a chance to look at any current artists. But I think the most recent one was James Gurney. I would really liked his travel stuff. I love your art. Seeing the process live is so cool. Thank you. <laughs> Your take a loaf of bread. Insert bread for the amazing painting. Um, Clara says looks good. The hair looks holographic. Thank Richard you. Richard says you can't even tell there's half a bottle of orange on that sucker. <laughs> um, I guess he was warning us about the noise of the blow dryer. True. Um, Libra gang, also a Libra. I gotta go, but I'll leave the stream on to help. You're sweet. The colors look Thank great. You. It's amazing so far. My wife turned on her blow dryer just as Scott said, blow dryer confusing the heck out of the kid, but uh, <laughs> that's funny. I re only recently found your content, but I've really been enjoying it. Thank you very much. Fluffy or straight hair? Fluffy. Fluffy. Um, I love how much you style your artwork in your own way. More anxi art anxiety says, whoa, I left for five minutes and came back to fully shaded skin. I love it. Have you ever tried dream art? I'm assuming sketching your dreams. I, I did could, in, in high school, yeah. If you could go to any fantasy world together, where would y'all go? The Dreamland Chronicles. Yep. <laughs> Hands down. What is your favorite Disney movie? Little Mermaid. Beauty and the Beast. Oh, here. What? Oh, you're fine. Um, wow, it's a beautiful piece, Scott. Masterpiece, I'm here and back. I'm leaving now. Bye, Scott. That was Randy Sims. Thank you. She's really with 80s vibe here next. I love your videos and you give me so much inspiration. Thank you. Oh, bye, Raddy. Emma. <laughs> yeah, okay. I noticed her earrings. They look amazing. Um, Thank you. Sundu the Leaf Wing, wing says hello. Hello. So pretty, says Priyanka. Thanks to you, I've been getting motivated to continue to draw and not give up. That's it's Amaya. Oh, that's wonderful. Amaya Thank you. Has to go. She looks so mystical and tropical, says Pretty Woman. Oh, Mr. Mac Baby says good morning. Looks great. Good morning. What is the watercolor brush and color pencils you're using? Thanks in advance. Uh, there's a link to all of the stuff that I'm using in my bio, so you could actually see them and see where I buy them from. I'm obsessed with your style. Where do you find your reference? Uh, this one was just, I, I just did a search for South American curly hair. And this was just one of the pictures that came up. Mary wants to know how you feel about digital art. I think it's wonderful. Art is art. Yeah. Um, Prismacolor colored pencils. Is this your new favorite? Because it sure is mine. <laughs> it, it, it's growing on me. It's going to take me a little bit to get past the accident. Yeah. Ah, uh, thank you. Yeah, Bethany did link Scott's um, art supply list in the comments. So if you guys want to see any of the supplies that he's using, they're all in there. And none of those are sponsored. Boy, I sure do wish they were, but they're not. 
Do you draw buildings and landscapes or just spaces? No, I do draw buildings and landscapes. Um, when I go out and about, I will draw trains. Well, you can die now because mm. Ada said it's coming out beautiful. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Uh, yeah, any, anything, I'm, I love to draw it, except for hands. Wobble says, I only recently found your content and I've been really enjoying it. Thank you very much. Not Trixie says, it looks amazing. Thank you. It, it's Liz says, I love it, looks amazing. Thank you. Um, random question, do you have a Discord? I got into another stream yesterday and he has a Discord to tell people when the next stream is. I do, I do. Thank There's you. a link in, the, in our bio. Colored pencils or watercolors? Uh, is that like a preference question or what I'm currently? I don't know. Yeah, is that what he likes? I'm always scared or is that- Because there's both of that in this it? painting. Right. Have you ever used glitter in your painting and glitter would look beautiful for her earrings? Uh, no, I have not, but I have used pearlescent paint sometimes, like gold leaf. Glitter is the devil. It gets everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> like it never goes away. Yeah. Um, Ada said she'd think of the accent as a beautiful accent because it is. Oh. Rose says, once your hands are in normal shade again, you may really start loving this one. <laughs> Sophia Moreno says, I'm late to the live, but this looks beautiful. Oh, Sophia. Thank you. Had you been here 30 minutes before, Scott spilled all this orange paint <clears throat> all over the painting. Ada is asking if she can screenshot this to try to do it in her journal. Of course. Absolutely. And and if you go to the Discord, there'll be uh, scans of them. Right. Both the ink got... and the final one. Right. And Samantha, if you want to email me, I can send you the... Um, the black and white so she could try coloring it. Oh, what you like better, colored pencil or watercolor? Uh, watercolor. I, I did so much colored pencil growing up, I kind of burnt myself out on it. Uh, I don't understand why so many artists complain about hands. It's actually my favorite thing to draw. You're a wizard. That's unfortunate Lebanese. Yes, you are, because Scott hates drawing hands. I always want to try sketching and making little paintings. What do you think are good to try for a new beginner? Um, I, I like just drawing what you see. So go and draw everything. Draw buildings, draw food, draw people. Get used to drawing everything. Do you have certain color palettes in mind or do you just wing it and see what looks good together? Love how it's looking so far. I wing it. I always wing it. Aurora says you should draw an Italian place. Well, Aurora, let me tell you a small story. We want to go to Italy so we can draw every Italian place. Yeah. That is one of our goals. We want to go to Italy. <laughs> Ada now wants to go to Grandma's house to get a flower like that one to have in her room. That's oh. funny. Does Grandma have hibiscus? That's cute. Have you ever drawn chibi style? No. Do you like spicy, sour, or sweet? Sweet. How do you draw landscapes in outdoor places since it's difficult to bring colors outdoors? By the way, your art is so amazing. Oh, thank you. Um, if you look, there's a video I have uh, with my Swiss medic bag and it has all of my tools in it and including that is a travel watercolor kit. Mm -hmm. But if he doesn't have time to do the watercolors, he always takes a picture of what he's trying to paint and sketch and if yeah. he doesn't get to finish it, then he can do it later. Yeah can't stop looking at the hair, it's so beautiful. Sophia says the orange paint of Scott's fingers makes it looks like you've just demolished a bag of Cheetos. <laughs> Have you ever tried oil pastels? Uh, yes, <clears throat> I like them. And Samantha, she yelled yes, Donna, she would love to color, send you a big hug, she said. Uh, give her a big giant hug for me, please. And yes, Samantha, email me and I will put them all, there's like five of them, I'll put them all in the email for you so she can color them all. Do you prefer using warm or cold colors? Um, I like them both. It just depends on the mood. Do you do the curls like roses on purpose? Um, the curls? In the hair. Yes. It's beautiful, by the way. Thank you. Um, where is Sana says, hello from Indonesia here. I've been watching you a lot this month, and thank you so much for your art. That always makes me happy every day. Cheers. Thank you very much. It's very nice to meet you. Bridget says it's gorgeous. Thank Mary you. Mary Carolyn says, favorite Lord of the Rings character and you do you prefer Lord of the Rings or The Hobbit better in books if you've read them movies? If not. Um, I prefer the Lord of the Rings movie and The Hobbit book. There you go. 
And my favorite is Gimli from Lord of the Rings and Bilbo from The Hobbit. Shana says, so pretty. Alexander says, I hate drawing hands. Swati says, if you draw hair, does it automatically make you better at drawing pasta? <laughs> this is a genuine question. I don't know. I've never tried to draw pasta. Ash Tunes retracted a message. Scandal. Why not? Lydia says, do you like caracals? We do. What? They're cats. Oh, okay. Um, what's your name, mystery narrator? Oh, oh, that's me. Uh, Donna. I'm Scott's wife. Hi. Nicholas says, I'm gonna have to wash my hands for hours after this. Santa says, beautiful work. Blah, blah. Thank says, you, what's Santa. What's your favorite drink that you can drink every day and not get bored? <gasps> Tea. It's water for me. Tea. You should make a sketchbook on the ocean or for things in the ocean if you haven't. Hey, Fool of a Tuke says good morning. Had a yummy brunch, so I missed most of the stream. Oh, well, Yay! good morning. Hey, love some brunch. That sounds like fun. I'm always scared, says you. Oh, I read that one. Um, sorry. What is your favorite thing to draw besides people? Um, I like drawing places when I'm out and about. I think Have that's Have you kinda... drawn dragons? And if so, you and you like it you should draw try a wings of fire journal if you know what that is i tried this and made my favorite characters and then my clumsy book lost them oh that so, sounds cool emma a says my first time here and i saw your shorts and the work you did is so pretty thank you very much aurora says if you actually travel to italy you should do it and ravina all right uh, exactly and we want to do venice before it sinks into the ocean mr chaos says hi scott how's your day going so far, so good, Mr. Chaos. I think you were here earlier. Oh, Greedy Woman says, get an Airbnb in Via Reggio, take the train to Cinque Terre, go to Luca and rent bicycles, bike on top of the wall and around the city. Oh, Luca. Oh, that would be so fun. Um, Ada is asking how your morning is going. So far, so good. Oh, and she says the hearse is going awesome. Well, I'm glad. Yeah, we're doing all right. We need to go have some breakfast. Dawn is getting a little hungry. Bells Not Whistle says, I just bought this beautiful leather-bound copy of The Hobbit. <gasps> oh, I love leather-bound books. Oh, send me a picture, please. I would love to see it. Elizabeth says, your streams have been getting me back into the habit of drawing every day. I love the way your final pieces look. Thank you very much. Oh, that's very sweet. Have you seen Ralph? Bakshi's Lord of the Rings. I did. I grew up on those. That and the Rankin Bass one. Have you ever tried or was it Rankin Bass food? Hobbit, I think. If yes, then what's your favorite Indian food? I tried Indian food a long time ago, and I don't remember what my favorite thing was. Yeah, I, I haven't. Scott, you might never have drawn pastas, but he sure likes his noodling. And yeah. <laughs> that is funny. Sophia Marina says, speaking of tea, I just put the kettle on. What is your favorite one of your news? Watercolor. What's the longest you've spent on a project? Uh, it was 11 weeks on the Animal Crackers movie poster. Would you also say that that's the most complicated thing you've ever made was the movie poster? Yeah, I think so. Art with no pencil says, hey, I'm late, but this looks a lot better than it was before. Oh, thank you. Amelia says, hello, totally thought I missed this, but luckily I've made it. This one is gorgeous. I bet you questioned what you were doing halfway through with all that hair. I did. Misha says, hello, love your works. Hello, thank you. Um, Lauren says, hello, Scott. Any advice on creative burnout, creative blocks? Uh, go out. Don't stare at a piece of paper. Go out and look at other people's art. Go to a gallery, go to a museum. Uh, bring a journal. Oh, um, Ava says, my mom is making me breakfast. It is oatmeal with cottage cheese and fruit. Aw, that sounds delicious. Your mommy's very good to you. It's Liz. We are an hour ahead of you. What's your two's favorite book and movie? Oh, my God. Uh, the Princess Bride and The Hobbit. Mine are Jane Austen and the BBC <coughs> six-hour Pride and Prejudice. Um, what are your favorite places you've been to, and did you draw them? Yeah, um, I guess London and Paris, and, and we and got to draw them. a lot of drawing. I liked your, your drawings in Valencia, too, of the, the back, 
the back of the streets, back alleys, you know? The oh, windows, yeah, yeah, the yeah. The buildings. I love your drawings of Valencia. Abigail says, it's 9.30 p.m. here. Where are you, Abigail? You are farther away from me. I need some more allergy medicine. Alicia says, hey, greetings from Costa Rica. I found your channel this weekend. It's amazing. Thanks for sharing the process with us. Thank you very much. She is saying if he was close by, she would invite you to eat breakfast with her. Oh. <laughs> Ada, I would come and happily sit next to you and eat breakfast with you, girlfriend. I totally would. What is your favorite dessert? I would bring tea, too. What's your favorite dessert? <laughs> um... I think uh, chocolate ice cream. Funny Barry Art says this looks cool. Have you ever thought of doing digital drawing? Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Spork Spoon Fork says, I love your art a lot. How do you get this good texture with your line art? I have always struggled with mine looking stiff. That's just practice, honestly. You know, I think it always starts off looking like that and then you just gotta kind of work towards it. Guardian. Gardney says, I love your hair journal so, so much. I found your content recently and it inspired me to start watercoloring again. Oh, fantastic. Oh, wonderful. Share some of your work with us. Would you visit Finland if you had the chance? Absolutely. In a heartbeat. I want to go to Finland. I want to go see all the Scandinavian countries. That's on my list. Mary Carolyn says, Princess Bride is my favorite movie too. Raja says, and I lost it because I went too fast. Have you worked on any variant covers for comics? No, I just did regular covers for comics. <laughs> um, Star Trek, Mortal Kombat, etc. And then of course the Spider-Man books that I did. You okay, Google? We are almost done, honey. No, she's just restless. Um, Ashley says, size, love, Colin Firth and Mr. Darcy. You and me both. What superhero do you enjoy drawing the most? Um, Batman. I absolutely love your work, says Shadow Bane Gaming. Thank you very Long much. Off, who's your favorite Disney character? Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> um, love the white line work makes everything pop. Thank Imagine you. Imagine cool name here. Oh, I'm Lynx on TikTok. Very good. Um, what was your favorite and least favorite 60 days of the Masters? Um, Wander over a sea of fog was my favorite. I think I think my favorites and least favorites were based on how much I like how I copied them. Um, actually, I think the the um, the abstract ones towards the end were a little weird for me. The the, the triangle pyramid one. Yeah, you did not like that. Wasn't really my favorite, and my favorites were probably the Gibson girls. Did you, do you think animation is art? My friend asked me, and I think you'd know better than I would. I believe it is art. Absolutely. I, I was an animator for many years. We just made an animated movie. Um, I think it is 100% art. Frog says, oh wow, this is my first time being able to catch one of these lives. Awesome. Thank you. <laughs> she said, someday friend, we will have breakfast and she will bring the teas and you bring the tea. <laughs> You're so funny. She's so cute. Hello from Germany. Hello from Germany. the Hobbit Hole. Evening. Your work has inspired me to get back into my drawings. I haven't sketched anything since 2017. Wow. And I'm excited to see how much my art changed since then. Will be rusty, but I can get the hang of it again. You can. You can. Meta Squid says this is so good. Novia Scott's Little Whisper scandal is still lingering in my head now. <laughs> I love that movie. I had no idea you made it. I live in India and it's currently 9 30 p.m. here. Destiny says, beautiful Meta Squid says, best art ever. Oh, thank you. That is a masked hair piece. Get it? Masked hair piece? Masterpiece? Oh. What's your favorite piece of art you've made? The Animal Crackers movie poster. What is your least favorite thing to draw? Hands. Uh, 10 out of 10 art says Meta. Do you guys know thank which you. country watches you the most? Oh, you know what? That's a good question. I don't know. Do we know that? I think it's... Mm, it, I think when I've looked, it has been uh, the, U, the U.S., uh, Canada, the U.K., Germany, the Philippines. Um, 
Those seem to be the, the ones that I see the most. Um, Link says it looks absolutely gorgeous. Mary Carolyn, what's y'all's favorite Star Wars movie? Mine is Return of the Jedi. Um, yeah, that's a good one too, but I think I'll, I'll go with the classic, which is the original Star Wars. I like the one with Jar Jar Binks. <laughs> I'm totally joking. I don't like that one. Um, dogs playing poker, all those little details we discovered as you worked on it, says Rose. If you could be any dog breed, what would you be? I'd be a German Shepherd. That was Sundew. Hmm. Be any dog breed, what would you be? I think German Shepherd's a good one, I guess. Yeah, German Shepherd's a good one. I don't know. It's Liz says I have to go now. Bye. Sam says I'm from Norway. I'll have to think about that dog breed thing. Who is the person you draw the most? My wife. Uh, question from TikTok, from Anna on TikTok. Are you going to paint Rapunzel in this sketchbook? I don't know. I don't oh, know. If... That's a good question, Anna. I mean, you can almost call all of them Rapunzel in some way or another, right? True, with the hair. Um, let's see. I just turned 18 today. Hello, everyone. That's John Lawrence Day Day. Sorry, I'm late. Well, happy 18th birthday, Happy 18th. You a young little whippersnapper? Links. I think we are like three fans from the Czech Republic here. Indigo, this is a beautiful drawing. Well, I, we love the Czech Republic because they brought us... Um... <laughs> Erica says, Donna Misa likes, LOL. <laughs> You're funny. I would be a mutt like Uno or Arwen, says Rose. Oh, mutts are the best. What are your favorite colors? Uh, paint's gray. Not sure what I would be, but the kidlet is definitely a Verna Doodle and Alinda is a Corgi. <gasps> corgi. I could be a Corgi and wiggle my butt all the time. I love little Corgi butts. They're so cute. What's your favorite journal series you've made? Oh, that's going to be a tough one. Yeah, I don't know. I like my travel journals, honestly. Um, what are some artists that heavily influenced your art? I made a video on it, uh, if you look, from about a week ago, but uh, like my mom and my uncle and uh, Drew Struzan and JC Leyendecker and... All right, the dog is whining. Barbara Crystal says, floofy corny pants. Um, Vivian is asking, would you like to make Easter cookies for Santa? She wants to mail him some cookies. Oh, Easter cookies for Santa is a good idea. I think Santa Arwen would love is that. a rescue. That's her brief. What's your biggest dream as an artist right now? Wow, that's a great question. I think I'd like to make another movie. Um, and then other than that, I'd like to travel and fill up my sketchbooks with beautiful places. Yeah. Do you have any tips for drawing or painting in public? Yeah, get, get a set of headphones and take a picture before you uh, sit down and draw. So that way in the event that you got to get up, you know exactly what you were going to do. Yep. But all right. Wait, uh, this is a good question I want you to answer. What Sebastian asked, what's a tip you wish someone had told you when you were a beginner artist? To draw every day. <laughs> draw everything. Don't just draw what you like. Santa says, did someone say cookies? <laughs> cookies? <laughs> yes. Sam's daughter, uh, Ada, would like to make you cookies, Santa. For Easter. For Easter. She would like to make you some Easter cookies. I said cookies and someone's tail went wagging. <laughs> What's the thing on your right arm? It looks cool. Oh, these are just bracelets. This one was, uh, we got in Utah from uh, a Hopi, Hopi Nation mm -hmm. uh, artist. This one we got from our 25th anniversary in Kauai, and this one we got from Valencia. This is just a placeholder. From Amazon. From Amazon. Okay, guys, I have got, can I just say, from the spilling of the ink, this is amazing. I am stunned that you were able to make it look this good. Oh, thank you. I don't often compliment you here because everybody else does, but 
I personally would like to say that I am really, really amazed at how wonderful this came out. I think you did a fantastic oh, job. Thank you. Thank you all for hanging out with me while I tried to clean up the boo-boo. Okay, you guys, I have got to uh, get this dog upstairs. She is a little on the um, um, whiny side. So um, just yeah. um, tell everybody um, where they can find you and where they can find your art supplies. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna get somebody upstairs. <laughs> well, thank you all for hanging out. Yes, I will go wash my hands. <laughs> um, your art supply link is in the bio. And um, Bethany, maybe you could put it, put the um, thing in there and we're good. Thanks everybody. Sorry, gotta take the puppy up. Thank you everybody. Have a wonderful day. And uh, hopefully we'll see you tomorrow. Thank you.